Even yesterday in a different panel, a colleague of mine said, why don't we see city centers as managing a shopping mall? Now that might be just one color in the rainbow. Uh, I still like also that we pay attention to the consumer trends on uh, residential and uh, fit that together. And in fact, that's exactly what we're doing, for instance, in this city, I'm gonna, I'm gonna city say, center, gonna... but also elsewhere, densifying the residential, converting derelict offices to residential, but also converting derelict nursing homes to a combination, a hybrid combination of non-regulated rent and also some healthcare related residential in there. So, in fact, we're also motivated by our clients, which are pension funds. Now, think about this. They are there. Their main goal is to provide old age income. So, if you think about that, what a, what a wonderful alignment of interests could be made possible. So, if we can create affordable housing on the non-regulated side, work together with the social housing corporations on the regulated side, and apply all those niches in between, I'm sure there will be some spin-off also towards retail, whether it be uh, high street retail or neighborhood shopping, there's a good spin-off. We are generally interested in the soft fabric of the city to make that work. And once you have that, then you have eliminated a number of risks in there on, uh, on the property, uh, on the location, but also on the tenant side. And you can capture some of the value in there. That's why we are also interested in there. What you see today when you look at a lot of the investor strategies, they are focusing on cities. They are focusing not much more, much more about cities, city development and location. And I think given that they're focused on cities, there's a realization that is actually the demand side and therefore it's the consumer might be on the residential side, on the office or on the retail side. That, that is much more in the focus of, of investment strategies today than possibly 10, 15 years ago. I think a lot of investments when it comes to but possibly the Dutch office market with these fringe locations, office park locations, for many investors today, the, the, this won't be any kind of investments they will go for because they have realized that from the demand side, it's maybe not possibly this what a lot of the tenants want or what is a long-term sustainable investment going forward. And I think that has changed in the investment strategy. So it is the demand side, I would say. Maybe not the consumer, it's the demand side in general that is much more in, in, in focus for, on, on strategy development.